Hi, I'm Paul the Tall from PaulTheTall.com and I'm going to show you tonight that uh, Flat Out 3 works for the Mac. Well, first of all, it's more website on a cool stuff, lots of games, that's the Mega Man 6 games, or especially Windows games. And I'm going to focus at the moment on a specific game, uh, Flat Out 3 for the Mac. Well, you can go on several ways to the game page using the here button from the blog or the uh, Mac Game Port link from the top bar. Click on it, and then you can uh, go to, uh, for this case, it will be Racing Games. And then from racing games, racing games, you can go to flat out three, as you can see here. And then you'll find the game. Um, you can uh, uh, buy the game from uh, uh, GamesGate if you don't own the game yet. But you can purchase it here. And then, um, well, you get a serial which you can activate in, uh, to the wrapper in the Windows Steam. Um, you just go to um, download the wrapper which contains the Steam version just download the wrapper, click on it and uh, uh, you can extract it using uh, for, uh, for with the uh, because it's a dot seven z or 7 zip um, com well zip pro uh, uh, zip format so you can unzip it using uh, for example the free Keka and it will uh, uh, support this including uh, 7-zip as you can see here so you use this uh, software or if you have an, an already an, uh, a program uh, on Iga an Argiver which already supports 7-zip then you can use that one of course but um, I needed to use this uh, this um, compression um, format because um, yeah uh, this one has a very strong compression uh, power so um, use this one and you will uh, you can decompress it so after downloading the file from the download tab in up here which I uh, just showed you can um, you will have this file and then you can decompress it by just double clicking it if you double click it it will extract and you will got this file um, it's just Windows Steam installed into the wrapper so if you double click it the Windows Steam version will launch it's not the Mac version of Steam it's the Windows version of Steam sometimes I get questions about um, you know, that if it's um, the Mac version but it's this, the Windows version which you launch now it's install pre-installed into the wrapper and um, with it with it you can uh, install um, the game as well oh well you get the steam login screen well there and you put your account stuff and then um, steam will launch it might of course ask for um, an email verification it happens also for me as well then you, for you have to get an email and there you can uh, copy paste uh, the, the code in it and it will unlock again on your uh, on your steam and then you will uh, launch the steam automatically um, well then I go to libraries well, I got it already pre-installed in your case you if you don't own a game yet in steam then you click add activate a product click on next agree and use the serial which you got if you purchased on Gamesgate mentioned on the game page um, if you purchased it there then uh, you can use the serial from Gamesgate and then uh, put it in and then um, well, click on next and it will activate and it will install just as I did it uh, with my version um, then you click it just on play and it will launch the game after install of course because if you click on uh, on the install button it will off on the play of uh, if you act uh, activate the game it will automatically download it and then you will see a play button and you click on play and you got this well um, I will do a quick single player um, raise all over the world yeah whatever
Ah, that's nice. <laughs> well, then you can race. Present to the start. Okay. With the shift, you can boost the. Uh I think it's control. Ah, control. Oops. Whoa! Okay. One tip. Okay, this is important as you saw. Um, I would change the. Um, I'll go back. Abort. I will change the um, um, the keys, the configuration controls, because if you use the um, the control and then you press up, it will use the um, uh, the Mac option, the Mac quick keys. So you have to change the controls, otherwise... Um Boost. I will use the... Um, well, for example... Uh, um, M. Okay, this is a retry, but then with uh, <laughs> with the other key. So remember, if using control, it will take over the Mac preference uh, when using um, the quick key control uh, arrow. So to avoid that, change the, um, the configuration uh, key from boost to some, to another well function key like like C or V or whatever of the keyboard. No control. If you have a uh, low-end Mac, you can of course lower the resolution. Whoa! Lower the resolution um, and do the graphics a little bit lower. Whoa! <laughs> Ooh. 
<laughs> Almost three. Get lost. It works just fine as long as you change the correct configuration key. And C isn't really what I saw a uh, correct key either because um, it will change camera. So I don't want to install new Java version. I want to decide it myself. Yeah. Close. Anyway. So. Um, Works fine. You should have uh, changed um, the boost uh, to uh, another key, like uh, M or something, or N or whatever key is not used. So, um, thank you for watching. Hope to see you back on Polytool.com. If you love the work you do, you can always donate to my website, become a premium member, and support my hard work. And yeah, uh, spread the word and see you back on Polytool.com. Bye bye.